other ways you can just go to office.com log in as an emergency account okay so we have Much, much, much later. Okay, guys. So, nakalimutan na ako kasi may, ano pa mamaya, may orientation sa regarding Cloud Campus in the Blackboard. Okay, so, we're preparing na nga. Tara. Okay, okay. So, time check, guys, is 11am na nga and we're here na nga sa room para nga makapag-attend na nga tayo na USD Cloud Campus orientation which will be done through virtual or online yung orientation. So, required lahat ng students in different colleges na umaten nga dito. Okay, so dito nga guys, according sa post ng university, i-discuss yung about sa Cloud Campus or what we call is the uh, the Blackboard in which a social online learning platform or in simple terms, e-learning. Okay, so pwede kang, so pwede kang makipag-collaborate with your classmates, friends, through video meetings or collabor or collab, okay? Upload and download lessons, files, uh, submit assignments, and also you can do online quizzes or exams, and, espe and especially conducting online classes. Okay? And one more thing, as stated, they will also discuss other features and tools that are helpful for the Blackboard Cloud Campus. Okay, so, para maging clear pa about doon, so let's proceed to the orientation. Okay guys, so nandito na nga tayo sa UST Cloud Campus using the Blackboard. So for the orientation nga, ipunta nga daw tayo sa courses. Then after nun, uh, dito papalitan natin siya into others. Kasi dun yung orientation, ayan, nasa UST Cloud Campus Student Handbook and Learning Resource Site guys. And after that, we're gonna proceed to the contents then the USD Cloud Campus Orientation so sabi nga, lalabas nga yung Microsoft Teams watch on the web instead pala, i-click natin yung watch on the web instead tapos sabi daw is join anonymously so i-click na nga natin to anonymous to go back to so later on you can already check your uh, our official website so uh, once you are already inside our official website you will find this okay so this is the home page and you will be uh, welcomed by a video okay 
So the Indian environment for a Filipinos and Filipinos classes is called the Blackboard Bird. Ang tawag sa ating Filipinos program ng university ay USP Quad Campus. But the learning instruction program is called Blackboard Bird. So yung pong mga questions before about uh, what is LMS, bakit na sa tuition natin yung LMS, ang ibig ko sabihin. So, this is a work class called based learning management system. And most of the work is living in the institution work with Blackboard. Now, the University of Santa Tomas has been using uh, Blackboard since 2002. So, tayo po talaga ang pioneer in the use of uh, Blackboard LMS um, here in the Philippines. Um, also, with the respondents' lockdown, we want to promote the academic integrity of the test. Okay, so mawawala kasi yung academic integrity of the test if we will be um, cheating, okay, in the test. Okay, now uh, we also have our video management platform. So, for all the structures recorded video lectures, for the mobile app, you can check in your classes right away. Okay, what else, man? You can quickly view and use the say you have questions with regards to the use of the blackboard, how to submit, okay, how to join a group. Uh, everything can be found under the student e-learning resources. Okay, so uh, for your students, you can download the app for the Blackboard. So, for your have the website, we have the technical help there. So, you can send a technical support ticket. So if you have problems, you can send a technical support ticket. And uh, usually, the problem is with the uh, resetting of the password. Usually. <coughs> 15 minutes later. Okay, so the orientation nga just finished and it lasted only an hour. And it was a very informative orientation nga on how to use the USD Cloud Campus or the Blackboard. Okay, so... And also nga yung uh, they discussed the collaboration of the helpful tools and features nga. Para mas malinawan pa nga kayo guys, so bibigyan ko na kayo ng summary about sa... Naging orientation nga kanina regarding the USD Cloud Campus. Okay, so kanina nga, they discussed the Blackboard or the USD Cloud Campus. And sabi nga, it is an e-learning environment for, for synchronous or yung face-to-face -face classes and asynchronous classes. So yung mga distance and online learning. And isa nga siyang world-class cloud-based learning management systems can be accessed na using your internet browsers for laptops or the computers na by typing the www.usd.blackboard.com and free to download nga siya in your phones and tablets through the Google Play Store and the Apple App Store. Okay, so anywhere you go, uh, it's, it's very portable nga siya to your phone or your tablet. So, isa pa nga sa diniscuss nila is yung how to log into the Cloud Campus so, the format of the uh, email address for login is so sila nga yung magpaprovide ng email ad mo since galing nga sa G Suite. Okay, so, first name, second name, last name, then yung college mo, dot college. Okay, so, diba, kung education ka, dot edu, kung commerce, dot com, then at usd, dot edu, dot ph. And yung password is dapat maging unique siya. So, ibig sabihin, gagawa ka ng sarili mong password na ikaw lang mismo yung nakaalam, unique siya, and hindi siya makakak. And after yung discuss nga nila yung kung paano nga i-access yung mga courses or subjects, and also yung mga helpful and beneficial tools and features na nakasama nga sa USD Cloud Campus nga, okay, para naman nga ma-utilize nga yung uh, features, mapabilis, and uh, mapadali nga yung paggawa ng mga necessary tasks, assessments, projects, 
mga files, documents, and etc. Is una, the Microsoft Office 365 which contains the main apps nga that are being used in in uh, yun sa academics. Okay? okay, and it's offered for free. Okay, so you can install it in your computers for free so that you have the experience of uh, doing your assignments, tasks, uh, using the Microsoft Office. Okay, so libre siya for the UST students. That's, uh, that's based on the, on the orientation. And second one is the, the Google or the G Suite. Okay, so itong Google and G Suite offers the unlimited cloud storage nga sa inyong UST Gmail or G Suite and sa Google Drive. And pwede, pwede nga siya if you have assignments, works, files, or documents, or videos man, okay, or videos, and pwede mo nga siyang i-upload sa inyong Google Drive using your STG Suite account. And also, you can, you can also collaborate with each other using the Google Meet or Hangouts. Third naman is the Panopto, so in which the teacher or student can upload their uh, video presentation. So, to give a uh, clear explanation for that, this is applicable for students na may mga reporting sa kanilang class. And also, teachers, mga teachers naman or professors, they, they can also upload their video lessons sa Cloud Campus para makita ng mga students. And fourth is the Respondus Lockdown Browser. Okay, so wherein if there are online exams or tests that are given by the professor and nire-require nga yung Lockdown Browser, okay, it, it includes the prelims and finals, okay? So this Lockdown Browser is inalock nga yung computer mo, so meaning kapag nagtitest ka na, okay, pag nag-start na yung test mo, Bawal kang lumabas ng browser to search for oh, no. answers, okay? So, talagang lockdown na lockdown yung browser mo. This is to maintain the academic honesty and the academic integrity of the student. So, bawal mag-cheating. No cheating. Fifth, okay? So, for the fifth feature is the Grammarly. Okay? So, ang Grammarly is a plagiarism detector for the students to be guided uh, in writing their essays, uh, paragraphs, or research papers, academic papers. So that what they are typing, okay, is based on their own words and the knowledge of the topic na binabasa nila sa, sa internet or sa anumang reliable source. And in that way, plagiarism can be avoided and words that are being typed are written and concise. So pang aring naman or six, okay, same sa Grammarly is the safe assign. So nakapalog nga siya sa Blackboard Cloud Campus. So this one is also a uh, plagiarism detector okay, that is applicable to students who are writing their own papers, mga assignments nila, okay, yung mga essays, like essays, research papers, academic papers, okay. And sa mga teachers naman, okay, in the case of the teachers, they will try to identify which part yung may possibility na plagiarized yung gawa. So, ibig sabihin, may parang uh, hindi yata na paraphrase ng maayos, okay? may pagka-plagiarized siya. Okay, so, a safe assigns in is similar to Grammarly na nalalaman and naiiwasan yung anumang pangungopya sa internet or tinatawag natin na plagiarism. Seventh one is the Adobe Creative Cloud. Okay, so which is uh, suitable for students who are in the field of media arts, okay, and also for the College of Fine Arts and Design, and also to the senior high school students, so yung mga interested in multimedia, Adobe Creative Cloud is suitable for you. So, 8 is the Canva. Pinagamit ko kapag gagawa ko ng thumbnails sa mga YouTube videos ko. And ang Canva is a free graphic design tool. So it is also offered for free. Okay, based nga sa orientation kanina sa USC Cloud Campus. Very applicable siya kapag may mga projects kayo. Like may papagawa yung minsan yung mga professors niyo Like papagawa ng posters, infographics, or other designs na, na i-require sa inyong ipa-design. So pwede kayong gumamit ng Canva. I hope this uh, video helped you, mga kabadis, ko na mga tomasians dyan sa nanonood sa vlog ko. And, if, and if also, if you still have questions, uh, clarifications, or regarding this no, sa, sa Cloud Campus orientation, please comment them down below. Okay? Also, if you also have uh, video suggestions, you can also comment them down below sa comment section. So, I will 
uh, I will also provide links in the description box regarding uh, sa, regarding the UST Cloud Campus so you can para mas malinawan pa kayo so you can check it out for for more information about the UST Cloud Campus. Okay, so I think we have uh, reached the end of this vlog. Nalalapit na nga yung, uh, yung uh, pagsisimula ng online class sa August 30 na nga. Nagulat tayo dyan. If you like this video, please hit the like, subscribe to my channel, and hit the notification bell for you to be updated sa mga upcoming videos and vlogs. For that, maraming salamat sa panonood. Mark out!